His name is Maxwell Woods. He is a dynamic two-sport sophomore athlete at Chanhassen High School, driven by a missing fan and parent, and motivated by his mother. Maybe they should have known. This is Maxwell Woods at age two. He didn't just play with his truck, he pushed it the way he pushes himself. Watch him on a basketball court, and it's difficult to believe he's only a sophomore in high school. First year last year as a ninth grader, um, you could see it in him, you just knew. Um, but the part that really stuck out was the seniors on the team, we had fall league, and the seniors came up and said, we need Maxwell on our squad. Watch him on a football field, then it's difficult to believe he's only a sophomore in high school. His work ethic and his drive, like I, it's a couple of kids in his grade, but him in particular, it's, when you watch him at practice, he, it's like he watched the last dance with Michael Jordan. He's growing into local legend because he's talented, because he loves it. I love competing, always wanting to win, just one of my favorite things, and I just love, I just love the game. It's just so fun to play. But to understand where it came from, you have to look here at his biggest fan, because she knows her son as she knows basketball. His mother was a standout at Weber State, and his mother is there for him, always. I think he's motivated by mom. She is one of the toughest, most competitive, um, driven people I've ever met. She matters much because Maxwell is the oldest of four children, and she is a single mother. Single because when Maxwell was just seven years old, he lost his other biggest fan. His father, a trainer and coach and Division I athlete, died of brain cancer. You know, it's nothing you can prepare for, right? Um, life was turned upside down, and thank heavens I had my kiddos because that's what got me out of bed every morning and kept me going. He takes that with him every night, that his dad is with him. Very competitive, fiery guy, loving, loving father, really just wanting to be there for, be there for his kids, and it was just, he's super awesome, and I loved him so much. Life got turned upside down for this family, but what is not lost in the loss is what is known. What would he say about Maxwell? What would he say about yeah. Maxwell? Oh, he'd be proud. Smile yeah. from ear to ear. Um, just, you know, that's what's hard as your mom, right? Because uh, they, uh, he loved his kids, he loved his family. His future is bright. He is a rare student athlete that comes around not often. Now, whatever school he ends up at, whatever sport he ends up playing, they're going to be lucky to have him, just like we're lucky to have him. Uh, he's a winner, and he's going to go places and win, and he's going to win in life. He makes others better because he plays with an unselfish yet fiercely competitive style. He has a knack for playing well in the big moment, and that kind of spreads a little bit. And so guys, it's year older, year younger, they know who he is, and he's connected through that AU stuff with there's so many people around the area. Everyone kind of kind of knows who he is, and he, there's not a gym we don't go to that he doesn't know they're the best player there or who they're playing against. He knows everybody. And he makes others better because he has a mother who is there for him every step of the way. It's really awesome with her. Just good times, times where I'm not doing great and she's let, she lets me know and lets me hear it. And she just, and then she'll give me props when I deserve them, I guess. <laughs> he has a special heart and that's, that's uh, I think as a mom, yes, you love seeing him excel in the classroom, on the sports field or court, but to be the young man that he's becoming, a kind heart, a special heart that uh, speaks a lot more volume. He will be forever driven to the person who is missing. The one that pointed him in a direction, the one who he wants to make proud because he knows what dad expected of him. When I think about him, obviously I really think I want to make him proud and I hope he's just looking on at me thinking I'm doing great out there and I always just want to do my best for him.